Hello, hello everyone. It's video game time. You know me as the guy on the right hand side of the screen. My name is Darren. But there's a guy on the left hand side of the screen. Brandon, you better say your name if you fucking push that I'm Darren button again. Swear to God, I'm gonna hurt you. <laughs> I'm Darren. You! <laughs> oh boy. Alright, that's it. Stream over. We're, I'm turning this stream around and going home. Aww. <laughs> All right, well, you know what? You're lucky that I'm in the mood to rock with Mega Man, a.k.a. Rockman. <laughs> yeah, uh, have you ever played this game before? I beat this game on a rental. Holy moly, you beat this game I on a rental? I beat this game on a rental. Wow, I am gonna get my ass handed to me. I, I think this is similar to Mega Man Legends, which I saw my cousin play a lot, Ragai Flagai, who is hopefully here. And um, yeah, like he was, uh, he made it look really fun, and, and I thought it was just gonna be an amazing thing to get into. But I did play a little bit of it in my university days, and um, it, it was too hard for me to get into because the voice acting was too bad. <laughs> Uh, yes, the Mega Man voice acting is quite bad. Also, by the by, thanks for the follow, Horror Horror. Uh, but yeah, yeah, the voice acting in these, uh, the, the Mega Man games in this, in this, uh, time frame here. This, and also Mega Man 8 and, like, Mega Man X4. Woo, <laughs> it's, it's, a, it's dire. It's dire. Oh, man. Well... We'll do our best to appreciate the childlike voices. Yay! Oh, nice. Uh, we got Cryonesis here. Thanks so much for, for checking us out tonight. And uh, yeah, Mega Man 3 is probably my favorite Mega Man. Uh, Mega Man 2 is good. It's kind of hard. Mega Man 1 is really hard. Darren, what's your favorite Mega Man? Um... I well, okay, classic Mega Man. Yeah. Specifically, okay. I would yeah. probably, yes. yeah, I would probably go with two. Um, for for me, uh, like two and three are both pretty good. They're probably the top two, but two is just a tighter experience. I think three just goes on a bit too long, in my opinion. Yeah, yeah, I think I got it. Well, eh, eh. then X and Mega Man Legends. Wow. Yeah, Mega Man X is amazing. Um, is this anything like Mega Man Legends, Rag Guy Fly Guy? We're gonna find out. Yeah, yeah this this is a this is a port of Mega Man Legends to the sixty four. So. Ah, gotcha, gotcha. So I don't know if you were here or not, Rag Guy Fly Guy, but Darren beat this game on a rental. He beat it. I haven't got to like the first town or whatever. I never got the speed boots or whatever. But I remember watching you play it a lot, so I'm hoping that's gonna help me pull through. All right, well, should we get into it? I think we should, uh, before we do. Um, it's not always a contest, but you never know, Darren. Maybe I have some secrets. Oh my gosh. Not again. <laughs> Stay tuned to find out. Uh... <laughs> Whoa! Why does my guy look like that? Oh, okay. There we go. So, let's go. Ooh, I don't know. This looks kind of goofy. Turn. New game. Free look. Reverse normal. Ooh, let's check out this storyline. I'll wait for you. Don't worry. I'll uh, I'll watch your screen because they'll hear your audio. Yes. 
Man, that's kind of cool. I like the, um, I, got the I like the sound. Man, this is kind of awesome. Hey, is anyone hearing Darren's au game audio? I'm starting to wonder if we yeah, can. Yeah, it's... Oh, right. Now maybe we can finally get some money. Be careful. If anybody in the chat can let us know, can you hear any game audio at all? And if so, does it need to get turned up or down? They may be busy. Please get back to us if you're able. Yeah. Uh, let us know if we got to turn it up or down, because no game audio, but don't matter to me. No, we got to get more game audio for sure. You can't miss these annoying voices and the cool suspense stuff. Are you able to uh, up your game audio somehow, Darren? I'm actually. I'm not really. It is like it's like at the maximum. Oh dear. Okay. All right. I get to do the dance. Churn up the in-game audio. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. Well, it doesn't seem like there's an option for that. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm just kind of figuring out how to move. Wow. Okay, well, right guy, fly guy says he does hear it actually. Okay. So that's what he says. All right, um, mm -hmm. tell me when you're ready to go. Okay, strafing on the shoulders. Pirates. Jump. Shoot. Kick. Pirates? Pirates. Pirates? All right, I'm good, ready to go. Okay, I hear it, my volume just low, and I got to take a poop. Good man. All right. Wait a second. Can you see it? It looks like a small one. You should be able to take it down with your buster gun. Oh, I remember there was like a vacuum cleaner to like soak up the stuff. Turn right there. I think the vacuum cleaner arm was my favorite. Vacuum cleaner? Yeah, wasn't there like a vacuum cleaner arm? Mm -hmm. Oi, matey. Yes, I see a door. It's not far from your okay. Position. Oh, yeah. No, I think I can find the door all right. <laughs> no way I'm going to go through that door. Yeah. Got to check out what else is around here. Where are you going, Mega Man? Oh, nope. Like... All right. I do my own thing. I don't listen to nobody. Mega Man plays by his own rules. A fighting robot. Mega Man. Da 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 da. Okay. Watch out, there's something right in front of you. Of course I'm alright. I'm Mega Man. Did you go in the room? Yeah. I didn't. You didn't? Yeah. She just tells you once, and then she lets you do whatever the hell you want. Oh, really? I just assumed that they would just block you from going further. No. Pretty much just like any 
authority in my life. They tell me not to do something, and then I just do it anyway. Well, la di da. Hooray! Hooray for childless dads or dadless childs. There we go. Oh, no, no. Uh, <laughs> childless dad. I hope I'm not one of those. That would, that would be weird. Does Mega Man have human reproductive system or is all robot underneath? Uh, that's a good question. Uh, Darren, is Mega Man a cyborg? Man, is he a human? A is he all robot? Um, I think he definitely starts off as a robot, but at some point, I think there's definitely some human in there as well. Oh, I thought it was the other way around. I thought he started as human, and then eventually he gets the full surgery and goes full, full transhuman. Yeah. No, it's like you know, at like, well, see, if we got, if we want to get into the real deep uh, Mega Man lore here, uh, <laughs> in the Mega Man Zero series, you see, uh, humans and reploids, uh, you know, ba basically uh, started to merge together, and uh, oh boy. by the time of the Mega Man ZX series. Uh, reploids and humans were one race or something like that, I think. Wow. Yeah. Who'd have thunk? And so th this game takes place in the far future after Mega Man ZX. So wow. at this point, he's both. <laughs> I really like what Cronus has said. Fantastic. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I want to. Give me one of those. There we go. Now I have plus one attack for my extra attacks. Wow, this is a fun game. I'm um, surprised I didn't play it more. Where's Rush? Rush is in the 99 cent bin at the vinyl exchange. Sorry to tell you. <laughs> Dr. Light? Is there Dr. Light or was it Kane? I can't remember. There was like two different doctors, I think. Kane's from Mega Man X. Oh man, I feel like this guy sometimes. Like he's only got one good move. You just gotta move to the side a little bit. Poor guy. Yep. Come on, buddy. Beated by circle strafing. I wasn't even circles strafing. I just like stepped to the side a little bit. Now we just get to stare at him. Oh, he woke <laughs> Mega up. Man just gets a cheeky smile. Uh oh. Look out. I wish I was Brett the Hitman Hard. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. I was not uh, supposed to. Uh, real, real non sequitur. I gotta say, I don't know what it is about like the art style of this game, but I think this game still looks really good. That's exactly what I'm thinking. I don't know if robots get lonely. Do robots get lonely? 
I mean, maybe this guy's lonely right now. I don't think he's so much a mega man in this game. I think he's more of a mega boy. He's a real mega boy. There's a little Harvest Moon guy showing up on the screen here. Is this game mostly cutscenes? For some reason it kind of feels like like that Donkey Kong country television show. Man, that's an uncharitable <laughs> comparison. Yes, so Ragai Fly Guy is correct, but there are different Mega Mans for different timelines. So, in some games, he's not a lab assistant robot. Yeah, I think Mega Boy is an F Boy. That's, uh, I'll go down, hot take, I'll go down on the books. So long, eh, Bowser. Wow. <laughs> what do you mean? What was that? You never played Super Mario sixty four. Stick with us and you'll get to play it. Do you notice any differences between Mega Man Legends and Mega Man 64? I remember you telling me once that PlayStation, everything was triangles and N64, everything was squares. That's the wrong system. Sega Saturn, everything squares. That sounds right to me. Everything right now in this game looks more like circles and triangles to me. This looks pretty bad. I wow. So I feel like we've watched as many cutscenes as we got to play. But um, I would have loved it. I think when I was younger. We'll just have to fix her up. Looks like the repairs aren't going to be finished anytime soon. We'll be here for a while, I guess. This island. What do you call it, Mega Man? Cattle lock? Must have a town. Oh, so we just hang out? Somewhere. Think you could go take a look around? Oh, who's this funky monkey? He's dancing. Oh, I remember that. He's the guy you say that, right? He is doing a little dance. Oh, man, this guy rules. <laughs> yeah, we have been friends for years, little monkey guy. I, absolutely. All right. Oh, I figured out how to kick. Mm, mm, mm. I'm gonna kick that monkey. No. Take that. No. How could you do that? <laughs> Rag Eye Fly Guy is a really big fan of the monkey. <laughs> <laughs> how could you not be? You're a monster if you don't love that monkey. He's that mo that monkey stole my heart in five seconds. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> it takes some people years. It 
took five seconds for monkey. Oh no, the police! Mega Man's going to the slammer. Oh wow. I'm going into caves. <laughs> Let's go back to the monkey for the next 35 minutes. No man, um, we're gonna we're gonna go deep in this game. We're gonna go far. <laughs> Does have like kind of cute little sound effects as you're running around. Yeah. I think the last time I played this, I was like second year university and I was supposed to be studying. And so I have like a weird, uh, weird guilt in those years. I see. Oh. Oh, you found the town. You found a couple things. Eat your face for a free life? I guess that's kind of true. Oh. That is a thing. Get her head out. The, the cool thing is um, that we're both kind of playing a railroady game, but two different ways, which is kind of neat. We need a license from the government? Oh my gosh. This game is getting very realistic. And you gotta wear hard hat, what? safety boots. What the heck? Okay. Oh, you can like climb on the down ship and stuff. Ah, Mega Man! The police saw us crash land and came to check up on us. Well, you certainly put on quite a show. <laughs> but it looks like a good voice for the police man. Let me welcome you to Tantalox Island. <laughs> I'd like to ask one of you to come with me to the station. We gotta Maybe figure out where that is. Oh, here we go. Forms. You can get your registration and ID card. You can't enter the city without one. Don't worry. It won't take very long. Wow. This game While teaches you a lot about immigration forms. <laughs> Indeed. In the shopping arcade. Oh, the shopping city. arcade. You don't need an ID card to get in there. <laughs> Are you ready to go, Professor? Yeah, I'm surprised that they can, like, program all these voices. Yeah, there actually is a lot of dialogue for the 64. All right, off to the shopping arcade. Woo! Hmm. All right. Here we go. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, cool. I remember this. You get to like kick garbage or something, right? Oh. Eh. Kick the can. There you go. Eh. I think if you kick it in the trash or something, you get money. I'm trying to remember. Is that is that 
Why do I have these memories? Why, for the life of me, I can't remember my postal code, but I remember this bullshit. <laughs> like, there's something wrong with me. Let's see, we want to go to hip bone? Let's go to dressmaker hip bone. Oh, I can't because there's a scary little dog in front of it. And I'm... Oh, no, I can get Oh, yeah. Uh, people who haven't played this game before, it is a Mega Man RPG, for real. It's uh, an action RPG. It's kind of awesome. Yeah. This woman here just gave me shit for looking at women's clothes. Well... <laughs> man, the dialogue is kind of hilarious. It's like, you're not as good looking a man as George Clooney, but, uh, you know, you feel confident. I'm like, uh -huh. okay. Uh, she's asked me if the dress would look good on her. Like, what does this have to do with, uh, no. You sure don't know how to treat a lady, do you? Humph. What a jerk, Brandon. I just wonder if this has anything to do with the game. Will you buy it for me? Yeah, I'll buy it for you. Okay. Like, I don't... <laughs> this chick is such a slut. Yeah, I know. She kind of is. Jet lag bakery. It's, uh, it's actually kind of a sweet game. There's just a couple things that are hard to get over. Like, this voice acting is really bad. Um, but there's like side quests and there's towns and you get like upgrades to like your legs so that you get like roller skates and stuff. It's kind of cool. I never quite know how to feel about, Ooh, there's this new game called Mega Man 64 in this game. Oh my gosh. It looks pretty interesting. How meta. You know, I, honestly, I don't even think the voice acting is actually that bad in this. There's... Oh boy. I mean, I'm gonna—I'm certainly not gonna say that it's like amazing or anything, but it's not—it's yeah. not terrible. You know, that's something I gotta say. My good friend Darren here—he does not care. You cannot make him feel bad for liking things. Uh, that he likes. He just says, uh, you know what? He just says it the way it is. I like that. Like the time that he said that GoldenEye 007 is a 4 out of 5 game. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> uh, okay. I never know whether to appreciate or not in RPGs when you um, when you talk to people who don't actually have anything to do with the game. Like this guy just, I don't know, it fills the world. It kind of gives this kind of realism, I guess. Because like not every person you talk to in real life is uh, going to give you a quest or be helpful. But then my adult brain kicks in and it's like, I'm wasting my time. It's, a, it's one of the problems with getting old, I guess. Yeah, I don't, I, I can't, I can't, can't agree with you there, Brandon. I, uh, I'm all about the running around, talking to people. That's good shit. Yeah. But I think you got the right attitude, man. I just uh I think I'm just chronically busy that like I I just don't know how to be cool. Whoa, how the heck did you get over there? You got to talk to the right person. Wow. Oh, oh. That's not the right person. Uh oh. 
missed you missed a store <laughs> well thanks for the advice I remember these little guys. Yeah, serve bots. Let's see. It's probably okay. I've been to the chicks clothing store. I've been to that one. I've been to that one. I've been to that one. Bookstore. Okay. Uh, that one. Yeah, they're basically Lego people robots. Pretty much. Hmm. Okay. Now I can catch up with Darren. Camera's great. Yeah. Camera's okay. Yeah, I'm actually surprised that the controls actually seem to work pretty okay here. Mr. Blue Boy, that's me. Mr. Boy. Mr. Blue yeah, Boy. Mr. Boy essentially. Oh, okay, that was not good. Oh, Mr. Blue Balls. Hmm. Follow your nose. Zenny. I remember that stuff's called Zenny. Why do I remember that bullshit? Oh man. I love this little guy. Look at him. <laughs> that was the time of his life. <laughs> this is inspirational, you know. Yeah, you just want to be the best dancing monkey. Yeah, man. that's right. Not me. I want to be a grumple puss. I want blood and guts. And I want to have dead bodies in my teeth. Oh my gosh. That's that's hardcore. Yeah, I'm pretty I'm pretty bad. I'm a bad boy. Oh. I'm a kind of mean, scary looking guy who wears eyeliner. Listens to to uh, my chemical romance. Hell yeah. I'm so bad. So bad. I appear to be too stupid to know how to progress. <laughs> are you are you still hearing the guy's voice? Yeah. He must be up, I'm guessing. Oh, there's another way here. <laughs> right. Ooh, Zenny. These guys just fart out little things on you. Die. This guy is in all kinds of trouble. My name's Hippopotamus. <laughs> Did you choose Hippopotamus? I chose Hippopotamus. Nice. Come back soon, Mr. Hippopotamus. I'm glad you went the crazy route.
down we go. Whoa. Oh, that was cool. Got my ass blasted. Mega Man, were you able to find anything? Oh. Well, I can't seem to go down that hallway without... Town, I we guess go. we'll have to try digging for them ourselves. That's what the man at the junk store said. That might take a while. Which means... Huh? Hmm? Mega Man, what's that? It looks like a weapons upgrade module. Oh, Ooh, this? cool. Yeah, the junk store man gave it to me. He said we could use this car to hook it up. Wow. You mean we can use this car? There we go. Well, come on then. Let's get it attached right away. You guys are fast. There, it's ready. This weapon lets I want to kick him. Just drop them in front of an oncoming enemy and boom! Boom! Oh. Just remember. There's a limited number of mines, so oh, make sure you use them sparingly. Do you want me to explain what this weapon does again? I'll get to work on fixing this car up. This place is quite I'll the maze. I'll be able to help you out and maybe spot for you if I can get it running again. Oh, I got a ma uh, rapid fire. Nice. Where? Where are you? <laughs> I'm in that same place that you were in. You, uh, I think you took a wrong turn again. <laughs> oh, there. Now you'll be able to use the city gate. Once you save the guy, did you just leave instantly? Yeah. Uh, okay, I kept going. Oh, uh, okay. Pirate. We've received information that indicates there are some headed this way. So as a precaution, we're evacuating the civilians and locking the gate. Pirate? Um, our grandfather is still inside the city. Will he be all right? Pirates? Well, I'm sure he's heard the announcements of Pirates? Pirates? If I see him, I'll Pirates? Sure to Pirates? 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 I'm worried about Gramps. Pirates? I hope he'll be okay. Pirates? You wait here. Okay, Mega Man. Be careful. Okay, Mega Man. Okay, Mega Man. Mega Man. Oh, you can jump strafe. That's awesome. Doot doot boo doo. Hmm. Let's go and check this out. Is that her hair behind her head, or that, is that some kind of weird flare? Or... That's her hair, I think. Right? Great! We understand. You need to keep your puffs and whips as low as possible and stay on schedule. That's right. You got it. That is some incredible hair, for certain. Hmm. 
Okay, don't get run over. Got it. And I need a citizen's card. Oh, you can find Zenny in the garbage. Ah, uh, yes, I discovered that. So how do you get the citizen's card? Um, where what what have you uh, what have you done so far? I returned the junk dealer. Okay, he gave you the business. Yep. Yeah, there you go. You're on the right track now. Ah, uh, thanks, buddy. Okay. Wow, this town area is huge. Yeah, I remember there was like a news reporter person and like a game show where you have to like roller skate around town really fast. I remember that. Hmm. Do you remember that? No, I do not. I don't. I do. I don't remember a whole lot about the game other than I beat it. <laughs> and the final boss is another Mega Man. Another Mega Man? Another Mega Man. Another Mega Man? Another Mega Man. Another Mega Man? Another Mega Man! Oh my god! Can you guys. I can't believe it. Oh, you're in the cop shop. Yeah. I like the the tune. It's kind of neat. Yeah. So there's a man reading a book about ethics in the library. Uh -huh. He says that if you do bad deeds, your appearance will darken. What? That's dangerous. <laughs> oh, I just got hit by a car. Oh, no. Oh, my oh, God. Geez. He hit me twice before he buzzed out of there. Should have kicked him. Hey, I'm going to kick that car. Fuck me, you, man. car. Oh. Here, let me introduce you to the mayor of this island, Amelia. I'm Amelia. Nice to meet you. I'm an old friend of Professor Barrow. I worked we were the mayor of the last town. While I was in school. <laughs> it's a mayor of the last town. Yeah. Right. Oh, yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah. In the city. I'll bet anything they're after the legendary treasure supposedly buried on this island. There are a lot of stories about the treasure, but no one knows exactly what it is. I thought maybe you might know something about it, Professor. I've been in the digging business a long Kick her in time. Kicker but I haven't been able to find out anything about this island's treasure except legends and myths. Look, Mega Man, I'll be here for a while talking with Amelia. So why don't you go back and keep an eye on Rome? Tell her not to worry about me, okay? All right. Oh, 
Oh, jeez. You fell down, and then you just about got hit by a cat. <laughs> yep. Kick that dog? Poor gal. Probably help. I know you can't treat girls that way. That's right. Down, boy. Run on down. Cool your pixels. Cool all your right. polygons. There. there you go. You all right? Oh. Oh. I like how you just like reasoned the dog out of being angry. <laughs> uh huh. That's just some world class uh, Caesar Milan you, kind of stuff there. You just mind your own business. Yeah. Okay, uh, I think you should probably not follow that girl. Le leave her alone. She looks quite a quite ornery. Very soon there. Hmm. Oh yeah, vending machines. I remember that. Yeah, I'll have a cola. You. Omega Man. I am in the suburbs. Where's Gramps? What? He's talking with the mayor at City Hall. I hope he'll be okay. By the way, did you? Wow, see quite a lot of story. Indeed. A lot of story. A lot of RPG like elements. There's towns. There's chatting. It just feels so big and so absorbing. Indeed. This is the kind of game I think I would really like. If I wasn't such an old man who's in pain in a rush all the time. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Gramps. Gramps? I'm going to go make sure he's all right. Oh, wow. Look out, Gramps. Oh. Woo! Gramps. Hey, what's up, junk shop guy? Hey, Hippopotamus, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> I forgot I told him my name is Hippopotamus. <laughs> Oh yeah, gotta talk to the monkey. I talk to the monkey too. There, monkey talk. Hold it right there. You can't go in there. This area is closed off. Please, officer, let us through. Our this area is closed there. off. You can't go in either. It's dangerous. I got a laser gun. What's happening? Those pirates have attacked the island. Pirates? Like they said they would. They're after the treasure that's supposed to be buried here. Enough talk. You have pirates? to leave here. Now. Pirates? 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 They've occupied the gate over there. They're too heavily armed. 
Pirates? <laughs> Pirates? 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 Mega Man, I'm going with you. No roll, it's too dangerous. Let me handle this. But. All right. You know, it's too dangerous. Look out for Gramps, okay? Wait, are you crazy? Wait, where do you think you're going? These police suck. <laughs> Just like, hey, don't go over there. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> yeah, there's no way we'll catch him. Yeah. Oh, dude, they actually destroy the city. And then the rest of the game, you have to save up Zenny to repair it, if I remember. Mm, this is that, so cool. Yeah, that sounds kind of familiar. This is so cool. I like, what a great idea. There. But I got a better buster gun, so uh, I think I'm gonna save more city. Oh jeez. No way we're gonna give you the key. Let's get him. Mission start. Red is combat, blue is speed, and yellow is endurance. Okay. Oh yeah, you can roll and stuff. Come on, red one, you're just about dead. Oh, they keep driving over me and stuff. Wow, they're fast. Yeah, they got some speed on them. Oh, God. Yeah. Controls aren't perfect. Tell you that right now. No, they're certainly not perfect, but like I can't talk to this little little guy, but whatever. Oh, I forgot about my landmines. Holy shit, landmines! I totally forgot about those as well. This would be a good time for that. Yeah, it probably would be. I never even equipped them. Ooh. Special item. How do I use them again? There we go. Special weapon. Okay. Slow down, you bastard. I don't know. I gotta go after the blue one first. Wow, well, that blue one is mean. Too fast. There we go. My landmines will do the work. Hee hee hee. Landmine there. Landmine there. Mission complete. Nice. Oh, geez. Oh, is that a key? How do I grab that? I want to pick up the key, but I can't. 
Run into it. There you go. Who was that? She's got a face like she's just figuring out she has feelings for someone. She's mm -hmm. going through puberty and she's like, oh my gosh. <laughs> what this feeling is? Oh my gosh. Wow. Uh -huh. Are you sure you're still cool with this dialogue? Yep. Oh man, this track. Yeah, that track is awesome. <laughs> Shut up. You should have known better than to pick a fight with the bond. Of course, if you agree to become one of my servants, I suppose I could forgive you. What do you say? That way my brother will never have to know about what you did to us. Join up with pirates? I don't think so. <laughs> All right then, forget you. Fine, see if I care. I gave you a chance and you turned it down. Don't come back crying to me later. <laughs> oh, wow. Like, don't get run over. It does mega damage. Yeah, all right. Good to know. Good to know. I got to order myself one of these really quick here. I got to have myself a quick... Ow! <laughs> that <laughs> asshole. I was just about to... Oh, he just destroyed the vending machine. Oh, no. Don't do that. I think I'm dead. Oh, no. Yeah. We got a game over. Wow, look at that. Aced. <laughs> <laughs> Good one. Oh, wow, they sent me all the way to this screen. Wow. I mean, not bad. You're stronger than I thought. I'll give you credit for that. They're not fucking around in this game. Oh, they sent me back to this fight, too. Uh -huh. Ooh, Oh no. You saw me get hit by that guy. Yeah, you're having a bad time over there. Yeah, it can be tricky. Ah. Yeah, monkey, I will save. Hell yeah, bro. Yeah, especially after knowing when you die, you like really die. Indications are that the mysterious group of pirates will continue its offensive for the foreseeable future. Whoa, you can shoot out the we flying guys? Story of the day. Oh, yeah. At 2 o'clock this afternoon, the city center was attacked by a group of unknown pirates who demanded they be given the keys to the caves and tunnels underneath our island. The mayor has refused to give in to their demands and is currently under siege alone in City Hall. Local police are helpless in front of the power of the pirates' weapons. 
It may be only a matter of time before City Hall is destroyed. Hopes are rapidly fading as... I've just been handed this update, viewers. It appears that the robots and machines being used to lay siege to the city have been destroyed <laughs> by a single young boy. And now, that same boy has come through the gate and is heading to single young city boy. Hall. Wait! There he is! I can see him! He really is <laughs> Can this lone hero save the mayor? So dramatic. Oh my gosh. Mission start. Got him. Yeah, you're in the part where they start like really wreaking havoc on the city, right? What do the blue robots attack? You. They said the yellow attack whatever. They didn't say what the blue robots attack. The red ones attack City Hall. Oh my gosh. Where the f okay. Oh man, this is. <laughs> Those flying flying guys are trouble, eh? Yeah, this is a nightmare because it's like it's all like, hey, destroy the carrier, but I can't destroy the carrier because it keeps focusing on these other assholes that are flying around. These guys take like fucking a million hits to kill, apparently. Yeah. I wonder if we're supposed to like power up before this point, like we go to the junk cellar or something. I don't know. These construction robots are doing a great job doing demo. Sir R. Oh boy. <laughs> oh. 
Okay, I just destroyed one of the flying machines, and that seemed to be crucial. I like how when they tell you City Hall's beginning to collapse, they actually pause you so you can't stop them. Yeah, you got to just watch it happen for a while. Yeah. Like, not helpful. No. Not at all. And where is the city's, like, I saw a police force, like, where, what happened? Yeah, they're, they're on break, you know. <laughs> this you is know, what the, 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 the union says they got X amount of time off and, uh. God damn unions. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be the downfall of Mega Man Island. police station is all bummed up. Sorry, please. You guys were pretty useless anyway. Oh, my police station's pristine. <laughs> pretty sure my whole town is all messed up. Do it? The music stopped. <laughs> it just took that long. They just gave up. Oop. You gotta kill the flying guys, right? That's the thing. Yeah, that seemed it 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 talks about like, oh you gotta destroy the carrier and it points at that like bigger ship in the sky. But that is, uh, that's nonsense. You can't actually attack that ship. And it's actually talking about the three flying guys. I think I'm about to taste death again. Pretty sure. I am pretty close myself. And now you gotta fight some kind of boss? Yep. Oh god. Oh god. Die. 
Okay, so the bank, the police station. I'm pretty sure I lost like everything on this place. Oh. The construction bots are just happy. Well, I got a game over. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> not a not a rim shot. That was a hard fight too. That yeah. They're gonna make you redo all of it. They are. Mission start. Probably better though. You'll probably save your buildings more than you did last time. Honestly, my buildings were in pretty like the city hall was a bit more messed up, but I was I was laughing honestly. My buildings are all messed up. I got like one nice building. Oh my gosh! How do you dodge the missiles? Yeah, I was doing good at that for a little bit, and then all of a sudden it was just like, no, you, you're toast, buddy. No missile dodging for you. Ah! Okay, you can't outrun them. Oh, it's very difficult. I think I can taste death. Ah! Oh, that was pretty slick. God. No. You there. Oh, I dodged for a long time. Man. Game over. Okay. I, th I feel like I should deserve something for that dodging, though. Yeah, oh, I totally missed it. It's okay. I'll make a highlight later. All right. Running away, health. Jeez. You know, some of the healths are really hard to get to. One was just like rolling down the hill. Well, the good news is, all the flying bots seem to be very busy with me. killed i haven't even got to the boss yet yeah well at least the flying guys will drop some health right they do yeah they do i have a feeling that if you kill the like little running guy he gives you health you can shoot him you can burn him yeah look at that kick him Kick him. I can't kick. I drop landmines that hurt me. Am I dead? Just about dead. Oh, got deadered. 
tough fight. I feel tough like fight. they shouldn't have put us in this position. Like we should be powering up more or something. Doing side quests and getting better. Yeah, I don't know if they expected you to do some more exploring before you went into this or what exactly. This is kind of annoying where like I destroyed too many of like the ground robots so now the last flying guy I have won't actually like come down and fight me he just keeps going to get more guys and I can't end the I guess I just have to let them destroy some more city. Okay, bro, you've got like three of them out. <laughs> oh, man. Come on. Wow. Okay. Yeah, this is, this is Can you like, Can you come down here and fight me, please? Hello? Hi, fight me. Fight me. Hello? Ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying, okay? Fight me! Fight me! <laughs> fight me! Oh my god, okay, he's coming. Yeah, there's no radar or anything. Oh my god, that's... Yeah, no, I... I... Oh, that's horse shit, man. <laughs> I can't even find my dude. My buildings are mostly intact. No, never mind, the bank is... I can't even find my aerial dude. Okay. Okay, like fuck off, game. <laughs> That's so oh my god, I'm gonna lose because I could he fucking wouldn't come down to fight me. I had to let them destroy the city. That's fucking <laughs> garbage. Bastards. Oh man, I'm getting frustrated now. Yeah, this is tough. Oh, it's, it's horseshit. <laughs> that it is. Hey, you gotta let me fucking hit the guy as he's bringing the dudes in. You can't just be like, oh, guess what? You can't hit him when he's bringing the dudes in, so you just have to wait until he brings four guys in. You can't kill them. 
And then, oh, oh, guess what? Now you're losing. Now you're losing. They're destroying the same. Well, I can't fucking. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. That is. Oh, boy. That is maddening. I believe it. I just lost City Hall myself. Die. I lost the police station. I lost City Hall. But I have the bank. Alright. You're on weird baby thing? Yep. Weird boss. Luckily, I have uh, a lot of points into my buster, so I think I'm killing him a little faster. Oh, those missiles do so much damage. Yeah, they are intense. Yeah, that was like half my health there. Ugh! You can't dodge them worth a shit either. Like, oh man. Come on, dodge, you fool! No, I'm holy. And he just keeps pulling them out. Oh god. Die, die, die! I did it! Whew! I did it! <laughs> Wash with bated breath. Oh! Ooh, finally we get to see the villain. My religion is Transformers, okay? <laughs> My bad. Woo! Woo! That was close. Oh, you got him. I got, got him. him. I got him. Congrats. <laughs> All right. Let's hear what this guy's got to say. So ours is a fish, and he flies in a different fish. Okay. Yeah, I agree. It's not Mega Man 2 or 3. 3 is my jam, I think. 3 and then X, or maybe X and then 3. Yeah. You gotta love the children. You gotta love the children. Yay! I'm a fan. I'm a fan. I'm also a fan of this one. Welcome. Or this one. Yeah. 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 Soundtrack is amazing. There is at least one good tune in this game so far. This guy is so dramatic. Indeed he is. <laughs> when you get your mission complete, it'll be kind of funny. Why is she yelling, Mega Man? Mega I'm standing right here. Oh, man. Dr. Wily Stage 1 is so freaking good. Um, I believe it's made by uh, the lady, the same girl who did uh, Castlevania. Kunio Yamashita, I think. Mission complete. <laughs> Mission complete. Grant. Wow, so you think maybe the city is going to invest a little bit more money in defense since, like, gosh darn freaking 
pirates just come in? Mega Man, roll! Sorry to give you a scare like that. Pirates? Don't you worry though. I'm as healthy as I ever was. There, everyone yells at you. <laughs> That's a relief. We were worried. About <laughs> <laughs> You're right, Cryonesis. That's that's a really good point. <laughs> Always repeating herself too. Now we'll be able to look for parts to fix the flutter. I know it's not much, but it's the least I can do for you. Really is the least you can do. Only a class B license? <laughs> Northern forest. What? They weren't able to get the key, so they must be going after the treasure directly. I'm amazed they go to that much trouble. Even if they are criminals, you've got hmm. to admire their persistence. We've unlocked car mode. Who knows what will happen if they get their hands on the treasure? Inspector, I want you to arrest them immediately. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> I like how the field of depth is like so narrow that everything looks like it's just an empty field. I'm going with you. Rolls got curves though. Look at that. Holy. She must oh be about boy. nine, maybe ten years old. Oh boy. But next time you can count on me. It's okay, because we're a ten year old boy right now. Oh, okay. That's Mega Man's voice? Be careful, Mega Man. I'll wait for you in the car. If you find some parts that you think might be useful, bring them back to me. When they say be careful, they're saying don't get killed before you find the monkey. See you later. Because then you have to do that over again. <laughs> Where is the monkey? There's got to be a monkey. There's always a monkey. Hey, monkey. He's in the car. Hey, dancing with my monkey. Oh, yeah. <laughs> dancing with your monkey, eh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. Oh, there, I burned this little Lego man. What's in here? Hey, here comes somebody else. He doesn't look like a police officer. Hey, it's that blue guy again. We'll show him just like we showed that officer. We ain't gonna lose this. Oh, wow. So this is what would happen if the liberals managed to take away all our guns. Pirates would just show up. <laughs> is it? This is the liberal agenda. This, this is the kind of future that you get for voting Trudeau. I want you to think about what you've done. A future with dancing robotic monkeys? Sign me up! <laughs> <laughs> oh man, finally! I never believed in politics until this moment. <laughs> You're a single issue voter. That's right. <laughs> Do, 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 do. 
I don't know if my voice is going to sync up, but they're playing a tune. Yeah, this is a good tune. It's effective. I like the like synthesized instruments. Like it's sounds kind of sounds kind of neat. Mm -hmm. This stupid tank doesn't even know what it's doing. There we go. Just keep walking. Just keep walking. That's all you gotta do. Straight for the win. Is this the first 3D Mega Man game? I think it is. Yeah, this this and Mega Man Legends 2, those are those are the only 3D Mega Man games as far as I know. They made a two? They made a two. Oh, wow. And they also made a spinoff about, uh, about uh, Tron Bomb. Oh, wow. Those, are, those were only released on the PlayStation, though. Only the first what? one was on the 64. The second one famously ends on a huge cliffhanger that was never resolved because they didn't make a third one. <laughs> Oh, wow. Brutal. Mega Man gets stuck on the moon, and he's still there to this day. Oh, what? Are you for real? Yeah. <laughs> it's nice to know how this ends. Mega Man is <laughs> lost on the moon. That is quite the story. Okay, I think I killed everything. But uh doesn't seem to affect whether these guys get out or not. Oh, and if I go inside a building, then they all come back again. Well, that's yeah. going to be it. Yeah, I don't think this is a clear all the enemy situation. There's a cave at down here. Yeah, I saw the cave, but I uh, skipped past it because I w wanted to clear it. Oh, you think the coppers are going to do anything? You saw how useful they were in the city. Yeah, that's true. Okay, well, never mind, because you can't actually go into the cave. So I was wrong. <laughs> that's what? Uh, so Wait. maybe you do need to clear everything? I thought I cleared everything. Maybe I didn't. Oh, don't touch the tanks. Touch tank bad. Yeah. Tanks mess you up if you touch them. Mm -hmm. True to Mega Man fashion. Mega Man has that disease where if he touches anything with his skin, he gets hurt. That's right. He's got very sensitive skin. Yep. Very sensitive skin. And uh, like anybody in their 30s, uh, you should be using uh, skincare. That's right. tanks don't stand a chance. They don't swivel. Yeah, these tanks are chumps. Whoever built these tanks was a doofus. Oh, look, it's Monkey. These turrets, on the other hand, give me some problems. There we go. The turrets, you just gotta lock on and then uh, jump and shoot. Oh, jump and shoot. Why yeah, didn't I it. think of jump and shoot? Oh, that's a classic Mega Man move. I know. 
That's that's a real fuck up on my part, I think, there. Well, I'm happy to help. Sup surprised you didn't consider it, but you're there now. Oh, well, it was too late. <laughs> Yeah, oh, you got a game over. Shit. Well, at least he saved. Yeah. I can't believe I didn't think of the old jump and shoot in Mega Man. <laughs> yeah. That is a little unlike you. Yeah. Whoa, you found one of those? Yeah. Look, there's a treasure chest in it. Oh, I got a million dollars. Woo, I got a million dollars. What am I going to do with a million dollars? I'm going to buy an island. <gasps> and then I'm going to set it on fire. Oh, uh, yeah. that's That sounds like the way to go. This game really makes you feel like you're underground. I really like the mini map. Now it fills in. That's cool. Oh, these are like those, um, Oh, what do you call them? Those little helmet guys. Mets. Yeah. Wow. Taking out those turrets with the old jump and shoot is so much easier. Glad to help. Buddy. What a genius you are. Yeah, I even surprise myself sometimes. I found cannon kit. So now I guess I have a better gun. I gotta upgrade my buster a little more. It's pretty wimpy. It takes so long to kill stuff. Sure does. You even got the rapid fire that I didn't get. Mm hmm. Which is why I thought the game would be easier for me, but you're holding your own. Must need energy legs. Wait. <laughs> What's up? Oh, oh no, nothing. Nothing, you know, just <laughs> remembering basic game mechanics, you know, nothing, nothing too important. Oh boy. I found a trapped box. That's cool. Wow, a million dollars. I got so much money, I don't even know what to spend it on. Because I actually don't know what to spend it on. Because I just keep rushing through the game. Okay, I exit this place. Oh, you found Monkey Man. I found Monkey Man. Oh, 
Oh, I found a flower. Look at that. You found a flower? Mm -hmm. so you found a flower. Alright, let's get to business. This guy? Still nowhere near the bottom. Maybe we will need that key after all. He's coming. All right, everyone, quit digging. Our priority now is to get rid of our little blue friend, all right? Be careful and don't be fooled by his size. He's already beaten Bond and Frog. Let's do it. Magic. Okay. Boss fight. Mission start. Well, at least it tells you how to what? kill it. That's cool. Yeah, that's nice. But then the question is, how do you get up? It's a long way to get up there, man. There's some rocks. I tried going up like the way we came. Oh, okay. Ah! That green blob hurts. It sure does. Okay. Right, like I know that, but it told me to shoot the treads. Have I shot the treads enough? Oh jeez! Oh no! Oh boy! <laughs> Hang in there. Me too. I'm getting banged up. The tanks don't drop life. This one did. Oh. Count yourself lucky. Here come the birdie drones. This game doesn't F around with the uh, game over screen, so. No, it sure doesn't. Man, it's so hard to shoot those treads. Your your buster's got like no range. Yeah, it's not it's not easy. And even if like they stop, then you gotta shoot all the other stuff. 
Oh, he just punches me. I feel like I should have more range. Okay. <laughs> he just punches me like a chump and gives me a game over. I feel like it's impossible to actually get on this guy. Hmm, maybe you gotta drop landmines and then climb up there and hope that he just finds the landmines? I don't know. Yeah, I feel like we need, like, different guns or something. Something. Because my range on my buster is so bad. Like, I can't... I can't shoot him from up here.
You got deader? I got deader again, yeah. Yeah, we're not figuring this out. Okay, I got deadered. Mission start. This time. This time is the time. Like, they tell you how to beat the boss. They're so generous. Uh huh. Shoot his tracks. It only slows down a teeny little bit. It is a very minor slowdown, yeah. For how many seconds? Give me health, Mr. Tank. No health. Okay. It's gonna be like that. Oh, man. Well, I was briefly on the back of him. <laughs> you made it happen. I wish I could get some health. I don't get so much luck with these guys. Oh, about to get freaking killed again. Yep, no health for me.
try to play with one hand because I got to up my brightness. Baron should be able to remember the best way to beat this boss. I should? Mm -hmm. You should. Well, that's a... Well... <laughs> you got up there. Got up there. I did a minuscule amount of damage. <laughs> What matters is that you made a difference. That's right. Good luck. Oh, you're going to get powered up, eh? Yeah. <laughs> That's a smart move. I mean, why are we throwing ourselves at it over and over again, right? That's smart. I went to an optional dungeon before I came here, and it gave me a ma machine gun part, but I haven't bothered to go exchange it yet. Yeah, you can just shoot into the hatch from here, dude. Oh, wow. I'm helpful. <laughs> that did not work. I know you managed to jump up there. Managed to get any upgrades? You upgraded something? No. Mm. Your only option is splash mine right now. That sucks. Yeah. yeah, I got the machine gun arm from the optional dungeon near the tanks. on its head yeah i got up there several times but it did me no good i think i got this i what is happening here i don't this is horseshit when what? i got when i got up on him he just like instantly did like the big green ball attack every time and I just like, well, I gotta fucking bail out because I'm gonna get <laughs> murdered by it. You're just like standing up there, he's just like, hey bud, thanks. <laughs> I know, it's, it's lucky for me. Uh oh, big green ball attack. Oh, 
gonna die and he's so close to being finished. All right, well, that was a pointless endeavor because I didn't have anything to do anything with except for the mines. So, <laughs> yay! I don't, think the mines, I don't think the mines are gonna help you. No. I only need to hit him like one more time. Ah. Oh. Dumb green splash ball move. Don't kill me. Don't kill me while I'm climbing the wall. Don't kill me while I'm climbing the wall. I only have to hit him once. Look at his health. Oh boy. I'll be so upset. Can't quite, can't quite reach. Maybe I should have done a running and jumping shot. Open your hatch. Open your hatch, you bastard. Oh, I can't quite reach it. Oh, I can't quite reach it. Come on. Mission start. Come on. Just keeps doing green ball move. And then he'll go just out of range over here. Open the door. And green ball move again. Seem to have got him in a lock. And then I'll open the door. Ball He's always all he does is green balls. Uh, and I killed myself. Even though he's like just about dead, I had no more patience. Okay, it's it's neck and neck here. This is so frustrating. All right, I got no life, and he only needs one shot. Just one shot. So I'm, I'm going to call it right now, based on the time. These are our last attempts to add some extra pressure. Sure. I mean, I just got to hit him once. Oh, there it is. Come on, Mega Man, shoot it. Ah. Just about had it. Open your hatch. Oh, he opened the hatch. I got him. Oh, come on. <laughs> what, what was that? What was that? <laughs> uh. I could see that. I, I hit it. I hit him. I was so close. Should probably go and upgrade my my machine gun, but whatever, I'm gonna go for it. I don't know why it was so easy to get him all the way up to one hit dead, and then he just fucking green balled like crazy. Yeah, that, seems that that's my problem is that he's just always green balling.
Oh, wow, it does mega damage. What does mega damage? When he punches you. Oh. I should bother killing these tanks. They never give me anything. I wish I had a little more range on my gun and I could shoot into the hatch. Damn green balls. More green balls. Fuck the flyers. Fuck the flyers. Damn it. Another green ball. Yep. <laughs> it tells you you can jump on it, and then you go to jump on it, and it's like, no, yeah, you don't get to fucking jump up there. That that is a trap. You said the game was nice by telling us how to beat the boss, but actually, it was a, the game was tricking you. <laughs> I don't know. I'm starting to think that that's what we gotta do. Three green balls, okay. What's next, another green ball? Ugh. I was like perfectly lined up to jump on him. You got in the hatch. Man, it's like half dead for you already. Yeah, I'm, I'm doing all right here. I'm glad I can help. If you get ambitious, you can jump on top of it when it's doing that. 
Nope, I'm good. No ambition here. <laughs> oh, you're gonna make it. Good. I was so dang close, man. I was hitting it. And the game just like wasn't registering it for some stupid reason. There's a second phase of the fight. <laughs> no, it's dead. Seems to be dead. Ah. I'm gonna go get my mega gun. I think that's the way to do this. It's probably got more range on it. Well, I think that's gonna be uh, that's gonna be it. It's almost <laughs> midnight, and I'm turning into a pumpkin. No, that's true. That's true. Um, let me just show you one thing before you turn in. I want to show you a little something. So if you go over here and you fight the boss, right? Uh huh. He says, the robot's outer shell is heavily armored, but the hatch is nearly defenseless. Shoot the treads to slow the robot down. Then jump on the robot from the rocks above, right? Right. So what you do is you get blasted by the green stuff. Uh-huh. And then you shoot these treads here. And he tells you, don't do it, even though the game told you to do it. Uh huh. So you just keep shooting him. And watch this. I got this figured out there. You shoot this? Oh, hey! Don't get, don't get squished. Okay. Then you just keep shooting these treads here, right? Okay. And they keep telling you stuff like, don't do it. But you just keep on doing it. It looks like nothing's happening. Concentrate our firepower on him. <laughs> we will I'll check this out. Just because we outnumber that kid's going down. Good. Don't get deadered. Okay. And then eventually, like right about now. This time, we get rid of you, boy, for sure. And get that treasure. See, look. Yep. See how there's smoke coming out? Oh yeah. Mega now he moves slow. I don't think he moves that. I I was doing that. I don't think he moves that slow. You do that. Oh, you did do that? Oh yeah. I was watching you, and I didn't think you were you were doing that. No, I was doing that. Yeah. Uh, okay. The thing the thing is, it didn't matter because he just fucking green balls. <laughs> yeah. So you can't he does. you can't get on him because he'll just green ball you. <laughs> like that. Yeah. What a doofus. Well, congrats, buddy. It's a. Uh, what do you uh, What do you make of this game? Uh, I had a pretty good time with this game. I think you know, like like I said earlier, this game like looks really like really good, really good actually. I, th I think this might be the best looking 64 game we've played thus far, honestly. Um, the gameplay is, uh, you know, a, a little bit clunky, but, uh, you know, honestly, it, it actually it actually works pretty well. It controls pretty well. I had a good time. I'm going to give this game a five. Five. 
What? Five, five. A five out of five? A five out of five. Five, five. I can't believe you. I can't believe you. Look, this game is so broken that two veteran players have been trying it for like an hour and they can't even pass a broken fight. And you're going to give it a perfect score. <laughs> yeah, I am. How? How is that even possible? <laughs> well, I don't think we were playing it exactly right. We were kind of rushing. We didn't. You explored a little bit more than I did, but I didn't do any exploring. So I think part of the problem was our own our own dumbness uh, trying to rush because we're doing this on a stream. And part of it is a challenge to see who can get the furthest. Um, so I think that's our own faults. Um, oh, wow. Wow. Can you believe this, ladies and gentlemen? Can you believe this? So when a game is perfect, but... It's kind of like, you know, maybe a little bit too tricky, like GoldenEye or something. It's like, eh, it's a four out of five. But then when a game is hard, and it's like, no, it's not the game's fault. It's our fault. How does that work? How does that work? Well, you see, it works because GoldenEye is a piece of shit. <gasps> One. Oh, no. <laughs> How do you... Oh, man, that was... That shot's fired. You know for what? Sure. See, I... it works because first person shooters are duty and third person shooters are coolie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. I can't believe this. Someone, please, in the chat, like, please tell me I'm not insane. Is this a perfect game? Is this a five out of five perfect game to you, Brian? <laughs> I'm going to select, yeah, Mega Man says yes. I just selected oh. yes there. Mega Man agrees with me. <laughs> oh, man. Run. Um, look, it's a frustrating game. I heard frustration in your voice quite a few times. And it's not you. It's the game. Like, you're trying to defend City Hall, and they're like, defend City Hall. And it's like, you can't. And, um, okay, yeah, you know what? That part was bullshit. I forgot about that part. The whole game's probably full of things like that. But I think you're you're using nostalgia to blind you and say that this is a perfect game. It's I, not, it's I, not even a... I, I would make the same argument for giving Goldeneye a 5 is that you're using nostalgia to blind yourself. To say that's a perfect game. That's, uh, that GoldenEye is still being played competitively to this day. There's people making movies on it. That game was so good, they made a movie out of that game. Who that's, can say that? <laughs> that's not how. how. Actually, that exactly no, that's and actually there are a lot, a lot of video game based, a lot of movie based, no, a lot of video game based movies. So that's not that unique, even if that were true. Well, it's not uniqueness. It's just a testament to how great it is. And I just, I just don't know how a guy can give Mega Man 64 a 5 out of 5, especially one of your fives. This game isn't even a 90%. This game isn't even an 80%. It's, uh, I don't know how you can do that. I could do that because percents can shove it up your ass. This <gasps> game is a good time. I enjoyed my time with this game. It's got... Okay. Look at this monkey. Uh -huh. Look at this monkey! Uh -huh. And tell me with a straight face this game's not a 5 out of 5. He <laughs> uh, <laughs> is pretty cute. You can't just put a dancing monkey in a game and give it a five out of five. Does do the fives mean anything to you? Do you just throw them around like they're nothing? No, that's huh? what you do. <laughs> no, it's what you do. Clearly, you get a dancing monkey in the game, and you're like, you know what? This is a perfect game. This is a perfect game. Never mind that we just spent an hour fighting an impossible boss, and then another thirty minutes fighting a, another screwed up thing. 
Uh, okay, look. This game reminded me of Donkey Kong Country, the cartoon, with its bad dialogue and its very long, drawn out areas. It has potential. It's really cool. It's an RPG Mega Man. But I feel like they kind of ruined both uh, action and RPG. Um, when I'm in town, I'm just wishing I was in a ruin. When I'm in the ruin, I'm just wishing I was not in there. The music's cool in parts. The voice acting is atrocious. Um, <laughs> the battles are clearly broken. No, I don't think it's our need of rushing. It's just that they're not polished well enough there there's no reason why two dudes like us would spend two and a half hours to just get past the second boss um, I mean, it wasn't two and a half hours just to get past the second boss yeah there's something wrong with this game i'm gonna say mm, Four. what was that <laughs> <laughs> nope, play it again. <laughs> Let me see. Again. Again. <laughs> again. Um, I'm going to give it, I'm going to give it a four with a side of dancing monkey. Cool. I can't right. give it, I can't give it, I can't give it a, an 80% plus. There's too much wrong with it. Um, but it's definitely a very neat game. Very cool. Will I spend more time playing it? Uh, maybe maybe i don't know will i beat this before i return it probably not i would beat it before i return it. <laughs> <laughs> I if you don't if you don't beat it you'll never find out about the other mega man oh yeah <laughs> well well i just got I, well maybe maybe we may return I may return. Possibly. Possibly. Four. All right. Well, that wraps this up. So, thanks All for right. tuning in, everyone. Thanks for tuning and in. We hope everyone. to and see you in, in the future. <laughs> See you later. Goodbye.